Very good morning to all the students. Today we are going to do chapter 7 of your grammar book, Adjectives. What is an adjective? The words that show the quality of noun or pronoun or add something to the meaning of a noun or a pronoun are called adjectives. Okay. Now, quality of noun or pronoun add something to the meaning of noun or pronoun. Such words are called adjectives. So let us clear this definition with the help of some examples. Example one, Ram is brave. Okay, here the word brave shows the quality of Ram, that he is brave. I have enough money. Okay, here the word enough is telling about how much money you have. It is telling about the noun money. Okay, so enough is adjective here. Rahul has two balls. Here, the word two is telling about how many balls Rahul has. Okay, so the answer comes is two. So it is the adjective. This is my house. Okay, if I ask the question, whose house is this? Okay, so the question about the house and we got the answer, my. Okay, so my is adjective here. These books are thick. If I ask the question, which book are thick? Okay, so we will get the answer, these. Okay, so here the word these is telling about the noun books. So these is adjective here. Okay, which pen is yours? Okay. The word which here is asking about the pen. Okay, so the word which is adjective here. Okay, so in all these sentences, we saw that how the words brave, enough, to, my, these and which are telling something about the respective nouns. Okay, so all these words are adjective. Children, to further understand the adjectives, let us see some types of adjectives. Okay. The first one is adjective of quality. Words that describe quality of a noun or pronoun are said to be adjectives of quality. Okay. The adjective of quality will answer to your question what kind of a noun or pronoun it is. Okay. Let us see it with the help of some examples. Ram is a tall man. Okay, you ask a question. What kind of a man is Ram? You will get the answer. Tall. Okay. She is a beautiful girl. You ask a question. What kind of a girl is she? You will get the answer. Beautiful. He is an intelligent student. Ask a question. What kind of a student is he? You will get the answer intelligent. Okay, so the adjective of quality answers to the question what kind of a person, place, animal or thing a particular noun or pronoun is. Adjective of quantity. Okay, the words that describe quantity of a noun or pronoun are said to be adjective of quantity. Okay, the adjective of quantity answers to your question, how much is the quantity of a noun? Okay, let us see it with the help of some examples. Mukesh has much money. If you ask the question, how much money Mukesh has, you will get the answer, much. Okay, she has a lot of coffee. If you ask a question, how much coffee she has? You will get the answer, a lot of. He has lost all his wealth. If you ask the question, how much wealth he has lost? You will get the answer, all. Okay. There is a little water in the glass. If you ask a question, how much water is there in the glass? You will get the answer, a little. Okay. So, all these words which tells about the quantity of a noun are said to be the adjective of quantity. Adjective of numbers. Words that describe exact number of a noun. Alright. 
here we will get the exact number of a noun all right uh, adjective of numbers is further divided into two types first one is cardinal adjective and second one is ordinal adjective okay the cardinal adjective describes exact number of a noun or pronoun let us see some example he has four pens she has two toys i have one sister here we see we have the exact figure about the noun four two and one all right second one is ordinal adjective it describes exact order or position of a noun or pronoun okay let us see some examples narendra modi is 14th prime minister of india okay here we have the position of the prime minister narendra modi that is 14th okay raj stands first in the class okay here again we have the position of raj that is first all right so this is about adjective of numbers possessive adjective words used to show ownership all right ownership means who owns a particular thing all right let us see some example this is your pen these are our chairs that is my car these are his book okay here the words your our my and his are showing the ownership of particular noun okay now as in the previous class we were reading about the possessive pronoun okay in that class also i had told you that how uh, the words your our my his are used as the adjective okay let us see how these possessive adjectives are used as possessive pronoun okay this pen is yours these chairs are ours that car is mine these books are his okay here in these sentences the words yours ours mine and his are used in place of some noun okay and in these sentences the words your our my and his are used as adjectives demonstrative adjectives the words that points out a person thing or animal are called demonstrative adjectives okay let us see some examples this book is thick that pen is black these boys are honest those girls are beautiful okay the words this that these and those are used as adjectives to point out the person's place animals and things all right now you must be thinking the same set of words are used in demonstrative pronouns all right then how the demonstrative adjective is different from demonstrative pronoun all right so let me tell you as demonstrative pronoun these sentences will be written as this is a thick book that is a black pen these are honest boys those are beautiful girls okay here in these sentences the words this that these and those are used before the auxiliary verbs is and are okay and in this sentences the word this that these and those are used before nouns okay just see books pens boys and girls all right so this is the main difference between demonstrative adjective and demonstrative pronoun interrogative adjectives in interrogative adjectives wh words are used with noun to ask questions okay now what is wh words wh words are who whose which and what okay now let us see some examples which pen is yours whose notebook is this what food is your favorite 
okay in these sentences we saw that wh words are used with noun okay it is used just before the noun okay now let us see how it is different from the interrogative pronouns okay in interrogative pronoun these sentences will be written as which is your pen whose is this notebook what is your favorite food okay in these sentences we saw that wh words are not written before the nouns it is written before the auxiliary verbs all right so in this way interrogative pronouns are different from interrogative adjectives okay children now let us recall all types of adjectives with the help of some examples okay adjective of quality baby has soft skin here the word soft is quality of the skin adjective of quantity i have some money the word some is quantity of money adjective of numbers sanjay has five cars the word five here is the number of cars demonstrative adjective that pen is mine okay the word that is pointing out at pen okay interrogative adjective whose bicycle is this the word whose is the interrogative adjective here used before bicycle okay possessive adjective my bag is heavy the word my here is showing the ownership of the bag all right so this is all the examples we have to recall about the adjectives all right so i hope this will help you to understand the adjectives better okay if you have any doubts or queries you can write down in the query section and for your assignments you have to complete the exercise of chapter 7 that is adjective okay and the solution to this assignment you will be getting later on all right so till then thank you very much and god bless you all